This box contains plutonium, and not just any plutonium, but a pretty special sample. When I was in the United States, I was lucky enough to be given a tour of the University of California, Berkeley by my friend Phil. It's a beautiful campus filled with intimidating buildings and Australian gum trees. Around 1940, a dream collaboration of researchers worked here. Lawrence's radiation group had just invented the cyclotron, which allowed them to synthesize new radioactive elements for the very first time. Seaborg's chemistry group could then characterize the physical and chemical properties of these new elements, often only working on very, very small samples. Oppenheimer's quantum quantum physics group was also nearby, helping them to understand the fundamental nuclear processes occurring. And that's exactly where this sample was made. This is the first sample of plutonium ever made that is large enough to be visible to the human eye and to be weighed. It is a small amount of black metal deposited onto a tiny platinum disc. It was the largest sample ever produced at the time. Within less than three years of this sample being made, the Trinity nuclear test exploded six kilograms of plutonium, a rate of scientific advancement perhaps unparalleled in human history.